How's it going, guys? I figured today I would talk to you guys about uh, why when you pick up a pet, uh, you're going to want to consider it to be part of your family. The lifespan of your pet could be really, really, really long. Um, I'm not sure how long... Um, uh, Pueblo milk snakes are supposed to live but um, if y'all follow my channel for a long time you've probably met Henry he's the oldest snake that I own um, to give you a little background if you don't know who Henry is Henry is my Pueblo milk snake I actually got him from uh, a longtime friend I've had this friend for about 20 years um, it's my, my singer for my band uh, his wife her, her mom uh, was a teacher in school and had the snake for like 20 years ago when I was in school. So, I'm going to introduce you to Henry. I believe he's about 20, 20 years old. Um, I'm not entirely how uh, too sure on how old he was when, he got him, uh, when they got him. But, I know for a fact that he's been through hell and back to... Uh, he uh, did get a stomach virus when, uh, when after I had gotten him from my friend. I uh, had him for about six months and he got a stomach virus. And he actually had to take, uh, I had to inject mice with uh, antibiotics. And <coughs> I actually had to hand feed him some stuff in order to get him to eat. He hasn't put on, he's not fat, but he was where you could fill his bones and now he's up to, to wait he's a good eater now um let me show you he's kind of squirrely uh milk snakes and king snakes have a tendency to be kind of squirrely anyways um he doesn't musk anymore he used to musk on me all the time he is used to being taken out this is henry guys and he, he, like i said henry is somewhere around the 20 year old mark uh I figured uh, y'all get a good look at Henry since, uh, you know, I don't do a little, a, a lot of one-on-ones with my animals where you can see them when I do the reptile room updates. I kind of uh, skim by the animals, show you their enclosures and stuff. So I had figured I would give you a good look at Henry because Henry's pretty. Um, he did shed like three days ago, two or three days ago. Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, he is, like I said, he's really old. This is him full grown. So he, they don't get too big. Uh, like I said, he had eating problems. He does it now. He's currently sniffing me out. If you uh, see, you judge his length by him spreading out on my arm. He uh, isn't what I would consider a big snake. He's on the small side, but the plus side of that, uh, milk snakes and king snakes eat, have really high metabolism, so they eat uh, very regularly, so he usually gets a, um, uh, a couple large mice every like seven days, seven or eight days. These guys will eat like pigs. The more you feed them, the more they'll act crazy. Uh, like I said, uh, Henry here is really old. If y'all are thinking about getting a pet and you want a pet that you're going to have for a really, really, really long time, uh, look into your pet. Take really well, you know, really good care of them. Uh, take care of them really well. And you'll end up with something like Henry here, which Henry's an old man. I did try to, to breed him before. Uh, he, didn't, he didn't take to it kindly. He was more scared. When the other snake was in the enclosure with him. There's a look at Henry. Let me put him back. And then I'll talk to you guys a little bit more about Henry. Uh, or animals in general. Uh, old pillowcase that I use for a snake bag. To give you an idea of how long uh, some of these animals live. Is Henry... 
like last year, I thought Henry might have like a couple more years on him. As good as he's doing this year, he's probably going to make it another ten years. Um, so I don't, I'm not sure what their recorded lifespan is, but like I said, he's going on twenty years. I wouldn't be surprised if he makes it to twenty eight. Like I said he's an old man. Uh, he's doing good. Henry's doing good. Um, if you're gonna look into getting a pet, guys, uh, just keep in mind. Uh, look at your pet as a forever pet. Don't look at it as like a, a fad. Like uh, you get it now and then later on you don't want it. I just wanted to make this quick video let y'all see Henry. And uh, talk to you guys a little bit about if you're going to get a pet guys. Try to make it a forever, forever pet. Try to, you know, don't make it a, look at him he's twitching. <laughs> he, uh, try to make it a forever pet. Try to uh, pick and choose your animals according to how long you want them to be with you in your family. Um, so far, the animals that I have right now are forever pets. I don't think I will be getting rid of them. At one time, I was trying to sell uh, Popeye and Ruby. Uh, but I've had Popeye and Ruby since they were babies, and I don't think I could part with them. Uh, anyways guys I hope y'all enjoyed the video today and meeting Henry if you hadn't already met Henry uh, I'm going to go put him back in his enclosure um, as always guys like comment subscribe all that good stuff and you'll be seeing this video probably on Thanksgiving so happy Thanksgiving guys uh, don't eat too, too much look at his twitching he does a twitching thing I think that's his hand right there uh, don't eat too much food, guys. As always, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Much love.